Hi, it's Lita Lom's Apotheca, and today we're going to discuss which kind of vitamin C to use on your skin. Uh, there's some controversies about which one, so let's discuss this. So I've been using a sorbyl palmitate, which is a oil soluble, white powdery, um, and ester derived from a sorbyl ascorbic acid and I've been because it's oil soluble I've been using this in my facial oils like my rosehip seed oil in the morning on my skin and uh, apparently according to this PubMed Derma Derma Med study it uh, could increase or it did it wasn't controlled clinical studies, but if it's possible, I'm curious. It's used a lot in sunscreens. Um, because it's oil soluble, it's easily combined in a lot of skincare. Um, but your skin, your cells are, the, the reason oil is so nice for your skin is because your skin absorbs it. So because this is oil soluble, maybe it um, is absorbed into your skin more quickly and more easily into the cell wall so maybe that's part of the problem, I don't know, but um, it could increase your sun damage. So maybe if you're still using this for a, a night at night, you could use it with your uh, oils, but I don't know if I would use it when you're gonna go out in the sun. Um, and it's odd because it's used a lot in sunscreens and a lot of cosmetic um, cosmetics because it's oil soluble. I don't know, but to be safe, I'm gonna go back to my ascorbic acid, vitamin C, which is uh, water soluble, and just a little bit because it's so sticky, and I want it to, let's see, I'm just gonna put a little bit of water on it, you know, so that it's um, dissolving in my hand, so I'm not gonna, I don't have to, and I would do this before my oils in the morning, you know, it, it could sting a little bit depending on how cultured your skin is to it. Um, so you could always just slice up some lemons and put it on your skin. Asorbic acid is what occurs most readily in nature. Uh, so, and then all the other ones are derivatives. Um, so I don't know, I don't always wanna have pulp all over my face. I often do, I love pulp all over my face, but sometimes you know you want to do you want it to be quick and easy so lately what I've done in the past is I've had this little white you know it's a little container of the asorbyl palmitate I'm gonna switch that now for the asorbic acid and just do kind of like a toner to wash my face have a little asorbic acid it's sticky you know just a little bit like I might just wet my finger dip it in and put it on my face as a brightener and as an antioxidant for your day, and then whatever facial oils afterwards. So, what do you guys think about that? I um, that's a little sketchy because it's widely used in a lot of skincare. Maybe it was, uh, it, maybe it's just this one study. If you have any information, or if you're at all concerned or want to talk, if you have any discussion about it, let me know. What do you guys think? Is that sketchy? If you like that video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and comments, welcome. Uh, let's discuss. And if you have any suggestions for videos, please let me know.